Zion is one of the busiest national parks in the United States, a very special desert oasis where people come from all over the world to recreate and explore. Most visitors know about our iconic canyons, spectacular views, extreme weather, and unique wildlife. But many don't know about the cyanobacteria beneath the surface of the water throughout the park. Hi there, my name is Samantha Pena and I'm a scientist in the park. I study and monitor the cyanobacteria throughout the Virgin River and its tributaries. This video is part of a series that will help you know more information about cyanobacteria so that you can plan your next trip to Zion. Cyanobacteria are ancient and are a natural part of life here in Zion. Some people refer to them as blue-green algae. They are photosynthetic bacteria found in lakes, reservoirs, rivers, streams that live in many other bodies of water around the world. In most of those places, cyanobacteria grow on top or are dispersed in the water. Here in Zion, cyanobacteria grow in mats like the ones you can see in this stream on the bottom of still and flowing water, also called the benthic zone. This type of cyanobacteria is known as benthic cyanobacteria. Benthic mats grow on the bottom and edges of water bodies, on rocks, sand, and on top of plants in the water. No matter where they grow in the water, cyanobacteria can harm humans and animals. Some species produce toxin chemicals called cyanotoxins. Cyanotoxins can be harmful if touched or eaten. The cyanobacteria that produce cyanotoxins come in different shapes, sizes, and colors. Some of the species that we've identified in the park are green and feathery looking, brown and veiny looking, and black and round looking. Families like this one, including furry family members, get information to make informed decisions about exposure to harmful cyanotoxins by checking the current recreational advisory on the park's website or by asking a ranger. If you have been exposed to cyanobacteria or are feeling sick, seek immediate medical attention and call the Utah Poison Control at 800-222-1222. If you're experiencing a medical emergency, call 911. Learn more by watching other videos in this series to learn about the different cyanobacteria in Zion and what to do if you're exposed to the cyanotoxins they produce. Until then, you can find more information about cyanobacteria on our webpage linked in the description below.